Remember I told you about the stately entrance? Okay, this is the rest of this entrance. Can you see the tower in the middle? It really is just amazing. So what I'm gonna do today is walk around to the side of the castle that's accessible. The other side, it rained a lot here and it's not as easy now walking over there. So I showed you a little bit of it yesterday with the garden. So you can see the stately palms. They're beautiful. And we were yesterday in one of the rooms here where I showed you they did the seafood. And this is just a walk among the palms. This is a cedar tree. These things are hard as a rock. They've been here forever, and they can withstand the salt spray. Not many trees can. You've probably seen um, pine trees. They don't withstand the salt spray at all. But look at this cedar tree, huge. And this is the castle. It is called Adelaide. And it was the winter home of Anne and Archer Huntington. This is one of the outer walls. You can see they have pretty substantial gates all the way around. And these, these were here, y'all, back in the day. You can see how big this really is. And then again, there's the fireplaces. Remember I told you they had a lot of them because they didn't have any other heat. You can actually hear the ocean from here. Can you imagine living in this castle and hearing the ocean every day? It's just beautiful. The beautiful color of the ornamental windows. A lot to see here and a lot of history here. That was a courtyard there. We were in the courtyard yesterday when we were looking at the seafood. Look at the shape of this tree. How about that? That's pretty cool. Again, it's a cedar tree. Beautiful ivy that's growing there. It's all along the wall and it's inside too. So we're walking back up now to the main entrance. for that little detour. Sometimes people walk in front of you. This is just inside the, the gate here. Um, they keep these big doors closed when Adelaide is closed. But it's beautiful in here. There's some more of those beautiful gates. And again, the entrance to Adelaide.